ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children yeah, of all right. ages. Yeah. Now, Friday, you have a test. We're doing a review on two things today. The first thing is inequalities. What are inequalities, DJ? Inequalities are... Excellent, DJ. Less than, greater than, or equal to. So when we're doing inequalities, we're comparing. And we're making it less than, greater than, or equal to. Now we have a strategy that we use if we want to get them correct. I'm just saying. If we want to get them correct. So let's look at a couple here. Let's take... Uh, Now we have these two decimal numbers. In order to determine, oh, later, later. In order to determine which one is greater or if one is greater, we line them up by place value. So we have 37 and 6 tenths. We have 3 and 76 hundredths. Making sure our ones place is over our ones place. Our decimal points are over each other. The tenths place is over the tenths place. The thousandths place is over the thousandths place. Well, they're not the same. So what I can do here is I can put a zero placeholder. Now, I don't need to put one up here because I don't say zero three. It's just three. But here, 70... Six, I'm sorry, six tenths is the same as 60 hundredths. Mm -hmm. So now we have the thousandths place, or I mean the hundredths place, the tenths place, the ones place, and the tens place all lined up. Now we start with the biggest place value. The biggest place value is what place? The tens. The tens. Is there a difference in the tens? Yes. One has a number and the other one doesn't. So the one with a three in the tens place, therefore, is going to be the larger one. So if I were to read this in words like big kids do, I don't say the alligator eats. No. I say 37 and 6 tenths is greater than 3 and 76 hundredths. Let's try and be able to use the words because I may at some time say, hey, write it in words. Where you'd have to write 37 and 6 tenths is greater than 3 and 76 hundredths. Just because I want you to have to do it that way. Let's take... <sighs> we have 2 and 561 thousandths. And we have 2 and 7 tenths. Again, if we are going to compare these, we write them down. We line up the place values. So here I have my ones over my ones, my decimal points over my tenths over my tenths. This one has hundredths and thousandths. Well, I don't have it here, so I'm just going to put it here because I don't change the value. Because 7 tenths is the same as saying 7 thousandths or 700,000, sorry. 7 tenths is the same as 700 thousandths. So we all be good there. Now what's the biggest place value we have to look at, Ava? Uh, the ones. The ones. Is there a difference in the ones place, Ava? Uh, no. No. Next we go to the tenths. And the tenths, is there a difference, Ava? Yes. Yes. You're going to see a question today asks you what's the, the biggest place value that there's a difference, or where's the first place value that there's a difference. In this one, the tenths is the first place value where there's a difference. We have a five in the tenths and a seven in the tenths. Obviously, the one in the seven in the tenths is going to be my greater number. Now, it is the exact same way if you're going least to greatest or greatest to least. Line up the place values. Put in any zeros that you need to see to hold those places so that you don't get confused and it doesn't change the value. Least to greatest, greatest to least. Ironically, we're doing two things today. We're doing adding and subtracting decimals. 
and we're doing comparing and ordering decimals. Ironically, the students are doing much better on this one than on adding and subtracting, which makes no sense to me. It doesn't. Because it's the same thing, if I wanted to add these two together, if I had two and 561 thousandths plus two and seven tenths, I would just do the same thing. I'd line them up by place value. And then I would add my zeros here. And then I would just do adding like normal, bringing the decimal point straight down. But for the love of Pete, five questions of adding and subtracting, and more than half of the students that have taken it already have not gotten a passing grade. Take your time. Work it out. Use your brain. Don't make me cry. I like you to huh? Yeah. Boom! Shakalaka. Peace out. God bless. Love you. Do Surprise! something. Surprise!